If you are looking into buying cheap and safe FIFA coins, look no further than footcoinshop.net. They have the fastest service, an incredible loyalty reward system, and the best prices around. Use my creator code INCEPTION when you sign up for your account and get a 5% discount with your order. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Sorry guys, this video is very, very late. Um, reason being for this is because I've been trying to do a new Road to Glory, and it's a first owner Road to Glory, right? Uh, I might be putting out the episode tomorrow or after tomorrow, something like that. Uh, it's going to be a really big episode because it's basically us getting involved uh, in the Road to Glory uh, when it comes to the types of packs we have to get and all that kind of stuff, right? So because I was kind of like super into it, I was like grinding a lot on it because I wanted to get specific cards and whatnot. But like I said, you guys will see the video uh, one of these days, because if you guys were watching the stream the other day, we were actually doing it then. So, yeah. But today, guys, we do have the uh, the new Philip Lom to check out. Uh, he is the new SBC card. Uh, with Lom in-game, guys, we're taking a look at someone who is 3-star, three 3-star. Three He's a right-footed player while being five foot seven, high, high work rates while being a short and lean minus body type. Now, with this card in general, guys... He does have different position changes, right? So he has right wing back, right back, left back, and the CDM positions. Play styles in game. He does have intercept plus. He has long ball pass, whipped pass, anticipate, slide tackle, and press proven, right? So a couple of interesting variables to work with. Now, with this card on a shadow chemistry style, he is going to be working with a 93 for acceleration, 91 for sprint speed, while also improving the defensive capabilities as much as possible, because obviously you kind of want to do that for a card like this. It's going to be very, very important. On the shadow, boosting the pace and defense, he's going to be working with pretty good passing stats, right? Pretty good passing stats with the good play styles as well. Dribbling also going to be in a fantastic area as well, considering the fact that he's also short and lean minus. Now, could he lack physical presence in game because of the fact that he's a smaller player with a short and lean minus body type with no strength and aggression absolutely we'll see if that's going to be the case with him because maybe like there's some sort of like hidden thing with him where he just bullies people anyways right well we'll see what the vibes are with the card right but on a shadow chemistry cell he will get that increased pace that increased defense for the most part while also working with some pretty decent physical stuff too so um with long guys we'll actually be using him uh, in the center mid position for a 4-3-2-1 just on cover center. And then we're also going to be using him in the right back position sometimes to see how he generally performs in that area as well. So yeah, we'll see how the card performs. Hopefully he's a beast. Oh, nothing there. Oh, a little bit of, little bit of the pressure there. The grand switch. Put a little bit of pressure, why not? Ooh, let's go long. Push forward. There it is. Oh, we're still good. We're still good. We're still good. Transition speed feels good with him. Pass it back upwards. There we go. Oh, he almost gets that green time finesse. I think if Lom had like more heights, maybe he would actually like block that out potentially. No animation there. Why you don't do nothing there? Ball is like right in front of you. Oh, almost. Almost, almost. Oh, I imagine I got the Trivella with him there. That'd be kind of sick. Little passing plays. Hopefully, makes this run here. Benzema does. Way too much on the cross, eh? That was a really, really good first time pass by uh, 
by Lom. I was clutch, man. Don't often get a score or good football goals, man. Lom with a great first time pass there. Oh, I should have gone to the other guy there. Lom did really well there on the attack, though. Nicely done, Lom. Beautiful cross. Should be a goal here. Nicely done. Lom has really good passes, eh? Like, if I have him as an attacking-oriented fullback, he actually passes the ball really well. Like, even that was a good law pass, like, considering the circumstances, you know? Manual go keep that, my G. Manual go keep that. well to cover there too positioning on the pitch in that um area it's pretty solid nice Lom was there though man if i wanted to make an extra pass i could to be fair No, I want the free kick. Yeah, I want that free kick. Hey, why not? He's not good at them, but... Nest shot plus, baby. A nest shot plus. I like his dribbling, man. He's a smaller player, right? So his dribbling actually comes off pretty nicely, especially when he's under pressure. Nice to work with that type of stuff. An S shot plus. An S shot plus. No, a little bit of emphasis there. It's always those first touches you gotta be careful of, you know? Ooh, almost, almost. Very close. Nice. I need to somehow get Benzema on my Road to Glory account, man, because this guy just does that authentic striker movement that I need. Oh, good first touch. Nice, Lom, let's go. Push forward, push forward, push forward. Dagger of a cross. Touch. Bang. Oh, I thought that went in, bro. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? About the movements, bro? Please, man. Benzema's that guy, bro. Touch. There you go, Lom. Let's go. Get involved. So I like. Little R1. 
Or one again. Ah. No, get it. Bounce pass. Not to him. Not to him. A little track back is nice, though, Lom. I'll take that. Oh, Lom. Let's go. First time. First time again. One more. And I, I mistimed it. <laughs> it's Dembele, too. Dembele is... Uh, that's going to be the worst one to mistime with. Oh, Lom, you gave him the ball, Lom. Why you do this, Lom? Why you do this? Ah, nice try, nice try. Almost got it. Tough man. Beauty. Driven. Come back up. Keep it going. Bro, you know how to try that. When the ball's in the air like that, you just gotta go for it, man. There it is. Good build, good, 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 good build up play. I speak English, guys. Oh, let's go, Lom. Super accurate on the cross again. Aw, oh, dude, come on, man. I wish I had like an acrobatic player, bro. If that was like Garnacho or something with that new inform, you know? Oh, that's beauty. And why? Because Lom has the crossing, man. His crosses are so good. Like the first thing you notice with the card, for sure. Oh my goodness. Oh, Virgil. A little bit, a little bit. Whoop. Oh, bro, if I scored Lom with his shooting, that would have been hilarious, dude. You know what time it is, bro. You know what time it is. Oh, he blocks it. Okay, okay, my boy. I have to do a little bit of that sneaky sneaks, you know? Get that cross in. Goodness, man, come on. What do you mean, dude? Oh, all right, Lom. That that awareness, I like it. I like it. We're good. We're good. We're good. it upwards there you go I see you llama I see you I see you I see you my boy and that's what we're waiting for there it is there it is, my boy. Let's go, Lom. Oh, 
Yeah, this is this formation is is just undefeated. This formation is undefeated, bro. And that like there's nothing that touches it for balance on the attack as well as the defense. It's just too insane to work with. Beauty. Benzema is literally my favorite. I love this card. I love him. I need him on the road to glory. Hmm. Yeah, he's going to lack in physical for sure. Like, that's me trying to use, like, the advanced defending to kind of push him into the, the attacker there. But obviously, he's not going to have, like, the physical capabilities to, like, outbody someone in certain situations. Like, you know, can Bembe just sit right there like that, you know? No, oh, the shooting. Ugh. The shooting. <laughs> you really got a green with him for sure, bro. That's going to be a rough shooting. Understands the pitch though, I like it. Ball roll cross. Touch, get the pass off. Ooh, it was close. Ooh, maybe on a green I would have actually got to that. Oh, close. I had to wait for Griezmann to transition, I think. Nice, long. Let's go. This is literally... He's my favorite player. I love his attacking AI. I love the way he moves. I love everything. I love everything. Huh, a red time strike and he actually hits it well. You see that? Imagine. Huh. Take some crazy strikes with the Yabo A. Oh, he pushed it there. Unlucky. No, Lom. Oh, dude, you don't shoot with him. <laughs> don't shoot with this guy. I mean, you can. You can score, maybe. But even the even the goal that I scored with him, like I say, was rough, bro. It was rough. We lost the ball there, but we got it back. Oh, pass it. No, too much, too much, too much. Okay, guys. So final verdict on the new Philip Lom SBC. So with this card in game, guys, um, obviously he's not going to be better than someone like an evil Lorente, right? Like Lorente, especially on that anchor chemistry style, given the physical boost, given the pace and the defense, uh, a card like that's in the right back. And honestly, in the center mid position, too, is very solid to work with in comparison, right? Because obviously, he's a taller player, all that kind of stuff. Uh, the stuff that you think you would notice with Lom is how he performs in game, right? Like, whatever you saw beforehand is exactly how he performs in game. There's nothing really special, right? In regards to, um, you know, him being significantly better or anything like that. But the card is still pretty decent. Now, what I will say is that 
the way that you end up using him in your team is going to be very important, right? So let's say, for instance, he's played as one of your two CDMs. It's going to be important to keep this card on stay back while attacking cover center and then to just play to his high, high work rates because sometimes this card, if it gets into certain positions where he can actually cross the ball, his crossing is very nice. Like his passing capabilities allowed me to score a lot of different goals, right? Because of how nice the crossing actually comes off. And obviously, if you have the acrobatic plus and you do that sort of cross to someone like Garnacho, you can kind of repeat a nice little bicycle kick with that bad boy, right? So um, on a shadow, you know, you definitely notice uh, the pace being increased. And you definitely notice the defense being a little bit better, but obviously lacks in physical presence in game as well, right? Because he's a short and lean minus body type player. Whenever you try to do like the advanced defending stuff where you go body to body against someone, like he's not really gonna be the type of person to get that specifically. However, because his acceleration and sprint speed is on the higher side, in the midfield setup, that initial acceleration and sprint speed is really good to work with for initial transition speed, right? And when it comes to just getting into the right positions at the right time, because defensive awareness wise from this card in game is actually very solid. Like when I played him in that center mid position and I just kind of like let him do his thing, he definitely positions himself really well in the pitch. And you know how um, Conte's card also has like he has like his own thing, too. I think he also has the intercept plus from what I remember when I did his Evo review. I think so. I think he needs more upgrades, maybe in like the pace department or something, right? Because Lom it felt more noticeable on Lom's card because of his positioning. His positioning was like way better to work with, in my opinion. So it's still a pretty decent SPC. I think the SPC price right now is 226K. So obviously, if you want to unlock Philip Lom because that's the best version of his card that currently exists, uh, then by all means, go right ahead. Do I think that there's better meta, meta options to work with? Absolutely. But he's still a pretty decent card in game. Like he's actually going to perform... Um, well enough for you especially if you need the links in your squad right with the german players and whatnot so um do i prefer again to use someone like an evil lorente and stuff absolutely do i still think this long card is pretty decent yes it's nothing crazy special but it's still pretty decent like you'll actually face people in the top divisions if they have enough fodder to just put towards uh these types of cards but um yeah hopefully you guys enjoy this video today i'll catch you guys for the next one peace out dudes love you guys